Your name is Peter Dore Karo Karo Sinuraya. So you just got Karo Karo Sinuraya a yes, few days that ago. Is added. <laughs> right. The yeah. question is, yeah. what does that mean? Oh, in the Karanese tradition, yes. it's actually the tradition that uh, somebody who want to marry, if he don't have a family yes. in the country, that somebody uh, welcomes him into a family, which is not the same family as bride or the groom. So, in the so actually, I'll have the Karanese tradition. Gee, my wife will explain it much better than me. Okay. <laughs> so they found a family for me, which was the Sinuraya family, and the Karo Karo also was added. I don't remember exactly why, but so Karo Karo Sinuraya, actually, that's, it's an honor to wear this name, to bear this name, actually. So in the tradition, I'm, this is my family, this is my father, my mother, and the relatives. And also in the marriage tradition, I, I depart from their home to the central building, and uh, my wife, Isenia, she is from the Ginting family, and she go to me, we join together, and we will be reunited like two families. So actually, my name in Indonesia is Peter Dore, Karo Karo Sinorai. Ah, excellent. <laughs> so you already passed the test about how you explain your exactly. name. Exactly, yes. <laughs> the second question is that, how did you start to love piano? Oh, um, yes. My, both my parents were musicians, actually. Uh, they met each other in music school in uh, Kent. Uh, both violinists, but my father actually had more uh, ambitions of becoming professional, but he didn't get the chance of his parents, because at that time music was not seen as a, a real profession. Uh, Belgium is really a working country of farmers, also of uh, uh, people who make their own uh, living. Uh, so very hard mentality, so actually, I'm the only professional musician in my family now. My grandparents were opera singers, professional in the time. So it's a little bit in the family, the tradition of making music. And they already saw very early that I was busy with making music. They sing perfectly on pitch. And uh, truly, I didn't want to play piano, but my, my parents urged me because I was very impatient. And a violin, I would immediately break uh, with the, I would tear it into pieces, I think, because I'm not patient enough. So piano, there was no choice, we had the piano. And I learned very fast without actually noticing it. I go faster than the other. And uh, yes, I was also very uh, stubborn myself. So I played the pieces what I want. And yeah, it became quite clear. It's not like it's really choice. Like it goes by itself very smoothly. I went to the uh, middle school, uh, like they call here, junior high school. Um, so for music also, and then I went to the conservatory, which is a high school special for music. And um, yes, actually I play already 25 years, so, uh, yeah. so the passion is really growing each day still, and uh, yeah, it's very evident for me to play piano. So you were yeah. started quite early, like when eight, you were five? Eight years. Oh, no, eight years. No. Okay. The standard age in Belgium. Yeah, so yeah. Sinjo, it's not too yeah. late for you to start? To love the piano. No. <laughs> she already loved, I think. But, ah, I'm sorry, I thought you were talking about Yesenia. <laughs> ah, okay. No. <laughs> so you were start when you were eight? Yes, yes. And you, so, you, your yeah. love to piano is growing, it's not like it push or force no, for you? No, it's a general for music. Uh, I call myself a musician because I not only love piano, but like all kinds of music I'm interested in, even Japanese gamelan. Okay. Which I will also, yeah. is the secret of my program, yes. I will tell later. <laughs> so, um, yes, ethnic music from all over the world. Um, so it's very large, actually. It's not only limited to piano. I improvise a lot. I make arrangements myself. Um, I try a lot of things, and yeah. But I'm no composer. I don't have the patience to write it all down. But So, actually, yeah. Nice. When... Some of you may also already see the video teaser made by Peter. He promised us that um, at the end he will have another surprise, a little surprise that connected to Indonesia. So yes. we are really looking forward to that. Ah, I will explain that okay. when I play the piece. Okay, <laughs> nice. thank you. The last question is that yeah. uh, within uh, two or three years, this is the start of 2019, how do you see yourself? Uh, what is your obsession uh, that you will pursue in the next two or three years in regard to musical career? Uh, yes, uh, I have quite a lot of projects. I have a PhD.
piano duo with two pianos, which I, uh, we will we already uh, recorded a CD, and we will have a second one with short pieces for two pianos, which is really impressive because you can really make imitation of an orchestra. You can do a lot of complex things with two pianos. Uh, also, to perform with my uh, fixed uh, musician that I play with, violinist, cellist, I have a trio which I play with very high level. I want to maintain that. Also, solo, I have some program like I really like Spanish music. I will play some Spanish music. And I want to do some like integral work of some composer. Yeah, really a lot of things to. Yeah. So, Very nice. but in the beginning now I will dedicate to my marriage, of okay. course, and Very that comes nice. first place. But uh, it will develop. That will develop. There are so nice. much things I still want to do musically. So, yeah. Okay, nice. So um, we will continue for the second part of okay. the concert. So enjoy for the second part. Okay. <laughs> 